All right, guys, so here we are. I've come down to a good mate of ours in Brisbane, a Queensland T-shirt company. Now, they've got all three types of printing. They've got the screen printing, which you can see behind us here. Callum's doing some prints, so you can see it in action. We've got uh, DTG as well and DTF all in one business. So we actually get to see how a single business can use the different types of printing processes for different customer orders. Now, first off, screen printing. We're in the screen print room right here. What is screen printing? Now, it's one of those real traditional garment t-shirt printing processes. Been done for decades, guys. And if we look behind, it's done using an ink, typically a plastisol ink, and it's printing and squeezing that ink through a mesh down onto the garment that you're printing, right? So it's using a big screen that's a mesh and it's had a stencil made on it. I'm gonna show you how that's actually done also as well. And guys, you're literally squeezing the ink through onto the t-shirt or onto the garment. You might do a couple of passes. Now, once you've squeezed that color through, goes around, you can see there's a flash curing over on the other side over there, which sort of makes it touch dry. And then if we have a look here, just behind Callum, what we've got is a curing dryer. Now guys, from a size point of view, what you can see straight up is this is quite a big space. It's quite a big equipment machinery operation here in terms of the printing, right? But it can be very quick, can be very fast in the way that it's getting through its garments. Um, and so really good for those one color, two color designs where you don't have a lot of setup, but you can just repeat time and time again. You could do 10, 20, 100, 1,000, 10,000, okay? So guys, what I'm gonna show you, this is the printing process you can see right here using a squeegee, ink through onto the t-shirt. Garments then go over here, they're gonna be cured. Now before this, we gotta ask ourselves, see this frame here, this screen, how is that made? Because that's part of that setup process. Well, we do that over here. We're gonna squeeze past Carl we're gonna go over here. Now, guys, just around the corner, come down this way. And here you can see the guys are using actually latest technology right now to create that screen, okay? So they're digitally printing an image onto the screen. What that's going to do is it's going to then be able to take that screen and expose it. And from there, we're gonna be washing it out. And what you're left with is you're left with a screen here that has a stencil in it of just clean mesh that allows the ink to print through, okay? And that's what you saw Callum doing earlier. This here is called emulsion, okay? And this is a UV activated emulsion. So obviously when you print the image on, we harden the emulsion, we're then able to wash out the print and it leaves you just that mesh right there. Cool guys. Now, obviously you can see here, we've got another dryer. There's another more sophisticated screen printing unit down here. This one here, able to do a higher number of colors, that sort of thing. So you can see the number of actual screen units that you've got on there. Now guys, why is screen printing and what type of job is screen printing good for? It's good for those t-shirt run, the traditional sort of garments, like cotton garments and cotton um, tops and things like that. It's where you want Fewer colors, but higher volume runs, okay? You don't wanna be screen printing ones or twos or five units or even 10 units because there's actually, as you can see, quite a lot of setup that goes on to doing a screen printed job, right? So it's designed for those higher volume runs. And to keep your costs down, if you guys can be doing one color, two color jobs via screen print, then of course, that's, that's where that screen print sort of printing process is best suited.
So guys, okay, so that's screen printing. Now, in this particular business here, it's all about a volumes game. The type of orders that come in, any order that comes in that's one color, two color, or three color, but high volume, very repetitive, the same design on lots of garments, that comes through their screen printing department because this type of printing is best suited for that sort of order. Now guys, I'm gonna take you on now through to their DTG area where it's very commercial setup. Okay, this is really a great space to show you DTG. Um, you can obviously get much smaller machines than what we're gonna show you here, but just to show you how DTG can really be used in a commercial space. Now the type of orders that they get are for DTG are the one-offs, the one, the two, the three, and onto your t-shirts and fashion and, and uniforms and things like that. So let's go have a look.